What's up guys? Welcome back to the Zach's Wildlife channel. I owe you an apology. You guys are getting this video a couple days late. Um, Western Wisconsin has been in a state of emergency. Uh, pretty much all of Western Wisconsin has been underwater at some point this week and it's just been really hectic and um, my wife wasn't able to go to work a couple days because the highway was underwater. It's just been gnarly. Um, here's a few pictures of the damage. So you can see that, you know, whole towns are just underwater. It's absolutely insane what Mother Nature can do. People's houses, people are losing everything. It's, it's really kind of sad. But a lot of road damage and a lot of even railroad, like we have tons of railroad tracks around here. They're getting just totally beat up. They have to rebuild the railroad tracks. So we're losing a bunch of stuff. Obviously fishing is pretty tough at times like this. But fear not, because today we're going to attempt another hike. Okay guys, so we haven't reached our destination yet, but I don't know how well you can see that behind me. I was driving by and all our bluffs are just surrounded by these white puffy clouds. It is absolutely beautiful. Reminds me of like a Mount Everest scene, you know, from Nat Geo. So cool. Just had to stop and share that with you. Okay guys, so I am leaving my car way back there and we are going to walk to the entrance of this trail, but it is surrounded by these million dollar houses. Plot twist. So we are at the trailhead. Um, as you can see, one of those really nice houses behind us. So yeah, we're just gonna kind of walk and see where this takes us. All right, you guys, so we made it to the hike trail map and uh, the last hike we did, I was somewhere down in here. I think this was it right here. Um, this hike, we are up here. We're coming down and we're gonna go back up for some reason and then go way down to this point here. And that's going to be the Rotary Vista Trail. So we need to follow the Rotary Vista Trail markers. So, I guess, onward. <laughs> hiking for about 10-15 minutes now alone last time I had my wife and child with me we we're making a lot more noise and that's what you want to do is make noise so that you're not gonna startle anything and get yourself in a predicament um, that you can't get out of so um, another thing is you're gonna come across things like this where I don't know how well you guys can see that that tree is just snapped in half and the only thing keeping the top half up is the bottom half when you run into this you should try and go around it which i can't because it's very steep on both sides so you're gonna have to just make quick work of it don't touch anything just run right under it and you know continue your safe travel Whew. 
walked him up to this stand, which usually means we're close to our destination. According to this, the circle numbers are posts, map posts. And I know we are on this trail. So we are probably 16. So the viewpoint should be shortly ahead of us. Let's go see. Alright, we're following you, Robin. We're following you. Take us to the viewpoint. Oh, you guys. I think this is it up here. Oh, Jesus. A few viewpoints. Oh, we made it. Oh my god, this is just a, a instant drop. Look at that. Holy cow. I wonder how high up we are. This is... Oh my gosh. Oh. Wow. Wow. You guys. It's absolutely insane. Whoa. Whoa. Holy cow. All right, you guys. This is it. This is our view. That's awesome. You guys, it is so worth it to get out of the house and try something new. Do a hike. Find a local trail. I mean, even if you don't have big heights like this, you've got, you know, the woods. I ran into... Um, a deer, I've seen woodpeckers. You know, I scared the crap out of myself actually when I was, um, oh geez, look at that rock. That rock is absolutely awesome. It's a huge rock. Um, there's just so much to see when you get out, guys. God, this is beautiful. Wow. Insane. So worth it, every time. All right, guys, I took a few pictures. I think it is time to head back down. And uh, guess what? I am still clean. It's a miracle. The This trail is actually not too bad. It's actually really beat down, kind of like this rock here. Um, it's just really matted mud, but it, it's sturdy. It's not slippery, so. This is awesome. This was a great hike. It was easy. It was a lot easier than the last hike. So hopefully I can remember how to get back down and I'll see you at the bottom. We made it back to the main outpost. Um, that was a lot harder back up than it was down. I'm actually sweating now. And I got a cramp in my side, so that's no fun. But do me a favor. If you like this video, please leave a thumbs up. Uh, again, I apologize um, for not posting Thursday. As you can see, there's just no way I can fish for probably another couple weeks and uh, I'm gonna try and uh, get out there a little further and do some higher some harder and some cooler hikes so bear with me um, as always thank you guys for watching to the very end please remember to subscribe for videos every Thursday if not Thursday definitely Saturday so, thank you guys. Till next time. 
Zach out. <laughs>